have you ever considered if you lose hope, then you're going to lose your dream of permanent weight loss? Don't let that happen. Instead, welcome back to the JoLynn Braley Show. This is a special 10-part sub-series of the show. Stop binge eating, stop emotional eating, lose weight for good. Hear their real results from the Inner Self Diet and raise your hope now. Welcome back to the JoLynn Braley Show. This is JoLynn Braley, permanent weight loss coach, founder of the Inner Self Diet, the diet that actually works, and the most important diet that you can ever do. In fact, I declare that the Inner Self Diet is the only diet that matters. Why? Because the Inner Self Diet heals the root of the real problems. The real problems are what drive you to continue to sabotage yourself with unhealthy food choices, with binge eating, with emotional eating, with stress eating, with food addiction, with food obsession, with using food as a crutch to get through your day-to-day life. Instead of looking for another food diet to put a Band-Aid on the symptoms, you need to heal the root of the real problems. Otherwise, the food diet will never last. Now, please pay attention. I'm not saying that you're going to lose weight without changing how you eat. You absolutely have to change your eating behaviors. But you can't change your eating behaviors long term when you haven't healed the root of the real problems. Does that make sense? And that's why I have been coaching amazing coaching clients since 2009. I coach smart, successful women and a few cool men to struggle free weight loss in eight weeks or less. I do this through my proven step-by-step system, the Inner Self Diet. It rocks. And you have just arrived into the introduction of my special 10-part sub-series of the JoLynn Braley Show. And this special sub-series is all about stop binge eating, stop emotional eating, lose weight for good, and raise your level of hope that this is possible for you by listening to their real results from the Inner Self Diet. So here's what we're doing. I am going to share with you over the next part of uh, the next Let's see, today is the introduction, so we've got nine more episodes of this special 10-part sub-series. I'm doing an introduction that I'm going to share eight audio interviews with you from Inner Self Diet graduates, and then I'm going to do a wrap-up show on the end. Why am I only sharing eight? Because I think it would be a little bit overwhelming to do a 20-part series or a 30 part series or a 50 part series or an even bigger series, I think that that's a little bit overwhelming. So I am limiting this here to a special 10 part sub series with only eight audio interviews of only eight coaching clients that I've coached since 2009 just to make it more manageable. If you would prefer to hear more audio interviews that I have done with amazing coaching clients who have graduated the Inner Self Diet, go over to fearlessfatloss.com forward slash blog. And as of the time of this recording, all you need to do is click on the menu link that says testimonials. And there's a drop down link under that that says audio testimonials. That's all you got to do. Click on that and you can listen to a whole slew of audios of people that have completed the Inner Self Diet. They have gotten amazing struggle-free weight loss results. Hear them tell you about it. Or you can listen to eight of those people here in this special sub-series here on the JoLynn Braley Show. You can listen in your podcast uh, player Whatever you want to do. Uh, Now, why am I doing this for you? 
The reason that I'm doing this for you is because of Roger Bannister. <laughs> what the heck does Roger Bannister have to do with permanent weight loss? And who is Roger Bannister? Do you even know who he is? You should know who he is. Roger Bannister is the first person to run a mile in under four minutes. He did this in 1954, May 6th, 1954 in Oxford, England. Why is this so important? Because before he broke that barrier, nobody had ever run a mile in under four minutes. As soon as Roger Bannister broke that four-minute mile barrier on May 6th, 1954, then there was another man and another man and another man. Today here in 2019, there's a uh, probably women who have also run a mile in under four minutes. I would have to research that. You could Google it yourself and Google Roger Bannister if you would like to know more about him. But the point of what I'm talking about here is that before Roger Bannister ran a mile in under four minutes, nobody else believed it could be done. As soon as he did it, now suddenly... Other runners believed that they could do it too. So I am going to share eight of the coaching clients who I have coached over the years since 2009. It's been 10 years now. So this is just a small sampling of people who I have worked with. And the purpose is to help you raise your level of hope and belief that you can do it too. However, I must give you a warning. You're never going to get the results that these coaching clients have got by only listening to them talk. And you're never going to get the results by listening to me talk. You have to take action to get the results of struggle-free weight loss in eight weeks or less. And it requires specific action steps. It requires a very specific formula which took me forever to put together. It requires the coaching and accountability of a high level inner self diet coach who has the certifications, who has the training, who has the background, who has the talent, and who also has the intuitive abilities to coach you out of your personal struggles into the freedom that you would love to be in. You will not step into that new freedom without taking action. Is that clear? What's the gist of what I just said? State it out loud. I will not get results without taking action. I must take consistent action with specific steps in order to achieve struggle-free weight loss in eight weeks or less. Did you say that out loud? I recommend you write it down. There's no magic and there's no room for magical thinking. If you want to get to your goal weight and stay there and you want to stop sabotaging yourself, none of my coaching clients, and you're just going to hear eight of them in this special sub-series, none of my coaching clients got the results that they got by just listening to me yammer on and on and on. None of my coaching clients got the results that they got by thinking about it, praying about it, hoping about it, wishing, lying to themselves, BSing themselves. No, they did the steps. They stayed accountable. They followed my whole system. It's an entire formula. And as you will hear, some of these people say in their interviews with me, they will say, I never would have believed it if you had told me before I did it, all of the changes and the wonderful experiences and the transformation that I would have. If you had told me, JoLynn, what would result for me by doing the inner self diet, I wouldn't even have believed you. So you're going to hear them say that. Even one of my clients, you'll hear her say, I don't know how you explain this to people, JoLynn, because there's no way to understand it unless you do it. 
So it does require a leap of faith, but really it's so, it's so much simpler than that. Do you want to lose weight and keep it off? Yes or no? All right. If you answered yes, the next question is, have you ever been able to accomplish this and do it struggle-free by doing what you've done your whole life? Yes or no? If the answer is no, then that might lead you to the conclusion to decide that I need help. I need help to do this. And the smart people are the ones that get help. In fact, you'll hear one of my coaching clients say that also, that she realized that in the past, before I coached her, she thought that it was a sign of weakness to reach out and get help. Now she realizes that you're smart and you're wise to get help. So if you don't understand what I'm talking about when I say the word coaching, and if you are serious about getting to your goal weight and staying there, and if you want to know more about coaching, then just search in my podcast for my other sub-series, Why Coaching for Weight Loss. That's a separate sub-series. And there I go over different questions and topics about what coaching is, the difference between coaching and therapy, things like that. It's, it's a whole, it's a separate series of its own. But you don't actually need that if you just get clear on the fact that you're miserable, you can't stop overeating, you can't stop sabotaging yourself, and you need help to get to where you want to go. And you're not willing to keep suffering and struggling in isolation any longer. If that is you, and if you want my help to make it happen, Go over to www.discovery-session.com. There's four steps that you need to take. Number one, on www.discovery-session.com, enter your first name and email address, press the button. Number two, on the next page, you got to complete the application for the call. At the time of this recording, as I'm speaking right now, The weight loss discovery session is complimentary. I do not guarantee that in the future it will be complimentary. At the time of this recording, it is complimentary. If you want to stop struggling with food and your weight and you're serious about getting help to do this now, then you might want to take advantage of the complimentary call, but only if you're serious. If you just want to talk to me and say hi, hey, that's cool. Go over to my Facebook page click like to like the page and also sign up for notifications. And then when I go live on a video, come on there with me live and type in the chat and say hi and I'll say hi. And and that's totally awesome. I love that. Also on my Facebook page, you can leave me questions. And if you have a topic that you'd like me to cover on a podcast here, this, you know, JoLynn Braley show is totally free. Obviously the JoLynn Braley show is not coaching. There's no accountability. There's no two-way communication. There's no commitment. So there's no results, really. You just got to get real here. You know, you're not going to get results without taking action. You need coaching to get there as fast as possible. You've got to have the formula. You've got to have the steps. You've got to have the expertise, the skill, the talent, the intuitive coaching. You've got to have the whole inner self diet master coach to guide you through it. So does that make sense? But if you don't want that, if you don't want to stop struggling with food and your weight and you just want to say hi to me, I would love to have you come over to my Facebook page and uh, do what I just said, right? That is totally, totally awesome. I'd also love it if you would go over to iTunes. Please leave a review of the JoLynn Braley Show. Give it a five-star review. This is a five-star show because I'm not just talking about Band-Aid symptoms and silly little diet hacks. The JoLynn Braley Show is meant to open your eyes to the fact that if you do not heal the root of the real problems, then you're always going to struggle with yourself, with food, with your weight, and that's just how it is. Because It's a psychological game. 
92.8% of why you're still fat is because you don't have the right mindset. You've got so much fat in your head, so much fat that you've been trying to stuff down in your emotional state, so much fat in your unhealthy thought patterns, in your limiting beliefs, in your hidden subconscious undercurrent of self-sabotaging, inner self-programming. And that's the most dangerous stuff right there because you can't see it. You can't see it. You can't, you can't get to this stuff on your own. How do you know? If you could have done it, you wouldn't be listening to my voice right now. Does that make sense? It's really so simple. Why would you have such a low level of self-love to hold yourself in misery and struggle instead of just reaching out to get the help that you could get to break free? Well, maybe you'll hear some of my coaching clients address that in these eight interviews that I'm going to share with you, all right? Maybe you'll hear at least one of them share that they used to think they could do it all on their own, and they were wrong. In fact, things only got worse for them the longer they struggled on their own. I don't know. I guess you'll have to listen to the audio interviews. Hey, it's totally free to listen to the JoLynn Braley Show Gosh, how many podcast episodes do I have now? Are there over 300? You could listen to one a day, you know? You still, in the end, nothing is going to change unless you take action. So I did not finish all of the steps that you need to take if you actually want my help. If you want to stop struggling with binge eating, stop emotional eating, stop hating yourself, Stop doubting yourself every minute of the day. Stop looking at this one that says eat this, looking at that one that says eat this, and then never actually doing anything and just continuing to make the unhealthy choices that you know will never help you lose weight. Hey, by the way, I have been there before. That's why I could talk about all this stuff like the way that I do, okay? I'm not some holier-than-thou skinny girl who's always just been skinny and is preaching to you, you know, I have been there in that horrible, horrible struggle. It really, really sucks. So I know what it's like, but it's a heck of a lot better to be on the other side where it's no big deal to live a healthy lifestyle. But you won't get that and you won't experience it unless you do the inner self diet steps, okay? Again, you can't just listen to me talk. If you like my voice, that's awesome. Thank you. But, you know, I'm not just here to be an entertainer. I am here to help my coaching clients transform so that they could feel wonderful about themselves and so that they can get to the place where it is struggle-free for them to live a healthy lifestyle so that they can get that fat off of their body and keep it off without it being any big deal. It is no big deal once you stop fighting with yourself. All right? But you got to do the inner self diet steps to stop that fight. Because right now, just hearing me talk about this, some of it, basic things might make sense, but you have no idea even how to get to that fight and fix it. How do you know? If you could do that, why would you be listening to me? You'd be doing it. You'd already be struggle-free with food and your weight. You'd already be happy at your ideal weight. You wouldn't have a problem. Okay, are you following me? Does that part make sense? So what are the four steps if you want my help? Number one, go over to www.discovery-session.com, enter your first name and email address, click the button. On the next page, complete the application for the complimentary call. Again, at this time of this recording, the call is complimentary. I do not guarantee that in the future it will be. Number three, after you submit the application, Make sure that in your email account, you whitelist the scheduling department's email email address. And that email address will be on the thank you page. 
okay? Number four, watch your email inbox because if your application is approved, you'll get a an email from the scheduling department to schedule you. And so there's actually a fifth step. You need to reply to that email within 24 hours of when the email was sent out to confirm your time slot. Why? Because we can't just hold a time slot and tie up my schedule while you're waiting around for who knows what. All right? You're not going to achieve permanent weight loss by waiting. You have to be decisive. You have to be excited. You have to be an action taker. What you're missing is the right action steps. What you're missing is the accountability. What you're missing is the full belief in yourself that you can do it. And that's one of my biggest jobs, I guess you could say, in the beginning when I'm first beginning to work with a coaching client. Because if I offer to coach them, which I don't offer to coach everyone, that's why there has to be that application and then the phone call first. If I offer to coach them, then we get going because the only time to get going is now. There is no someday for weight loss. Ooh, does this scare you? It will scare you if you are an addict because an addict always says tomorrow. An addict always says later. An addict always says someday. The winners take action now. The serious take action now. Ooh, is this too hard hitting? Is it too real for you? Then don't listen to this podcast. Okay, people, if you don't want to hear the truth, then go listen to somebody who's going to tell you that everything's going to be fine. Just keep doing what you're doing. Just accept that you're obese and just get to love your fat and and everybody else should just accept that you're fat. Well, guess what? Your internal organs don't feel the same way. Your internal organs are not going to be accepting. Your knees are not going to be accepting. Your back is not going to be accepting. Your feet, they're, they're not just going to accept the fact that you're putting so much stress and unneeded weight on them that doesn't need to be there. Your heart is not going to just, oh, yeah, let's just be fluffy and nice. No, your body can only take so much. If you don't value your life enough to do something about your out-of-control eating, then there's no point in listening to the JoLynn Braley Show because I'm not here to enable anybody to be so horrible to themselves that they continue to procrastinate on taking action to fix what is making them so out of control with their eating and making their body fat. It's never going to happen tomorrow. It's never going to happen someday. Not going to happen. Hey, this sounds like a get real episode. It's not a get real episode, but it sounds like one. And if you don't like it, that's okay. Just keep lying to yourself. You know how many millions of overeaters lie to themselves every day? I used to lie to myself. I used to lie to myself and say that I was going to do it on Monday or I'd do it later. I'd do it someday. Guess what happened with that? Just made me fatter. All right. Are you following me here? Is this making any kind of sense at all? Oh, no, this is this is too harsh, JoLynn. I want to stay in my comfort zone where I can keep eating. Okay, then do that. But then don't complain. Don't complain about your obesity or your overweight. Don't complain that your clothes don't fit. Don't complain that you don't like anybody to see you naked. All right? Don't complain about it. Cool. It's your life. All right? I'm here to help my coaching clients get struggle-free weight loss in eight weeks or less. I do this free weight loss podcast 
to spread the word that you're missing a huge piece of the puzzle. All right. I didn't even finish the steps that you need to take if you want my help. If you're willing to get real with yourself and stop lying to yourself, if you're willing to be completely honest with yourself, if you're willing to be coached, if you're willing to take action now, if you are serious about getting to your goal weight and staying there, if you're serious about finally feeling great in your own skin, if you're serious about getting to the place where you can live a healthy lifestyle without sabotaging yourself, if you want my help to get all this done, if you want struggle-free weight loss in eight weeks or less, go to www.discovery-session.com. First step, enter your name and your first name and your email address. Click the button. Second step, complete the application on the next page. Third step, whitelist the scheduling department's email address. That will come up on the thank you page. You'll see it. Fourth step, look for the email from scheduling because If you don't reply to the email, you're never going to get the call. Number five step, reply to the email to confirm the time. Or if the time is not working for you, then you need to follow the steps in the email. Without communication, without follow-up, without action, what is going to change for you? Nothing. Well, that's not true. What's going to change is you're going to be able to gain more weight and keep struggling. But is that a change? I guess it's a change because over time, your health gets worse. You feel worse about yourself. Your self-esteem gets lower. I mean, let's get real, folks. There's no magic here, okay? If you're miserable, you got to do something about it. Oh, I love what Dr. Wayne Dyer used to say. Dr. Wayne Dyer said, be miserable or motivate yourself. Whatever has to be done, it's always your choice, all right? What do you do, though, when you don't know how to motivate yourself? You don't know how to heal your inner self. You don't know how to get struggle-free weight loss in eight weeks or less. You don't know how to get to the place where it's no big deal to live a healthy lifestyle. You get coaching, people. It's so freaking simple. Again, If you don't understand what coaching is, if you haven't heard of it, if you don't understand how it could help you, if you just don't get it, but you want it, or actually you don't want coaching, what you want is to stop struggling with food and your weight. You want to stop binge eating. You want to stop emotional eating. You want to stop sabotaging yourself. You want to stop obsessing about food and hating your body. You want to get to your goal weight and stay there. Well, the fastest way to get those results is with coaching with the right coach. You got to have a highly skilled, highly trained, highly certified, highly intuitive, everything, the whole package. You need the master inner self diet coach. And when you get that coach in your corner and you're willing to take action, be coached, follow the steps, do the formula, then yeah, it works. I have never had a coaching client who did not succeed with my proven step-by-step system as long as they just did the steps, okay? Again, you can't just listen to me talk and expect things to magically change. That is insanity. Our friend, Mr. Einstein, he said, the definition of insanity is continuing to do the same things over and over again while expecting a different result. All right, so I want to wrap this up right here. This is just an introduction to this special 10-part sub-series of the JoLynn Braley Show. My only intention here in this particular episode, this particular uh, uh, podcast episode, is to introduce the fact that, hey, Now, what's going to be happening next is there's going to be eight separate episodes of audio interviews of coaching clients that I've worked with, and you get to hear them tell you their results from my step-by-step proven system. Why? It's all about breaking that barrier of belief that it's possible. Just like Roger Bannister broke the four-minute mile barrier back in 1954. 
All right, May 6, 1954, when he ran that four-minute mile, then everybody else believed that they could do it too. Well, if you listen to just eight of the people, it's a, just a small, tiny portion of all these audio interviews I have. Uh, when you listen to these people, if you do not get a raise in your level of hope that it's possible to change to stop struggling, then there's probably not anything out there that is going to help you raise that level of hope within yourself. You're just, uh, you know, you just don't want to believe that it's possible for you. And hey, that's cool. Don't believe it then. And just keep eating. Food is easy. All right. I've done it before myself. Food is super easy. Gosh almighty, you can go get food 24 hours a day. You can have it you can even have it delivered right to your house now. DoorDash, Grubhub, Uber Eats. There's even grocery delivery. You can get your fix 24 hours a day. Food is easy. So if you don't want to change your level of hope, if you don't want to believe that it's possible for you, then don't, okay? Nobody can help you. If you do want to believe that it's possible, and you need help to start believing it, listen to this whole series, listen to all eight of these people, and then at the end, I'll do a, a wrap-up to tie up this whole 10-part sub-series. All right, I will be back for the first audio interview with an amazing, awesome graduate of the Inner Self Diet. Come on back, listen in, hear what they have to say about it, and... If you're willing to begin raising your level of hope that it's also possible for you, then you will. Because I don't see how you could listen to these people and say that, oh, well, struggle-free weight loss. Ah, that's not real. Well, then why are these people saying that it is? But I'm sure that there will be people out there who think that kind of stuff. Cool. Think it if you want to. You just don't want to give up the struggle. That's exactly what I would say to anyone who doesn't raise their level of hope by listening to all these folks in this 10-part series here on the JoLynn Braley Show. Because there's just no way that you can listen to them and refute that struggle-free weight loss is real. However, the addiction to the struggle is very strong for a lot of people, not to mention the addiction to their crutch, to their drug of choice, which is the food. And it's not just a physical chemical addiction, but it's an emotional addiction and a mental addiction. And then there's the stories, the stories that go along with the entire struggle. And when you don't want to let go of your stories and you don't want to let go of the struggle, then you won't. And you will just continue on battling, moaning, being the victim. And there's a lot of people who they want to hang on to their story of struggle because they want other people to feel sorry for them. So you have to really, really, really want to lose weight and keep it off and stop struggling to be totally honest with yourself about your stories about everything that's going on in your inner self, in your inner world, in order to let that struggle go. And then there's the things that you can't see, which those can be most damaging because they've been with you so long and they're just that undercurrent of unconscious, negative, unhealthy inner self programming. And that stuff has to come up and be rooted out. That is especially why you need coaching if you want to stop sabotaging your weight loss. If you're okay with yo-yo dieting, then just keep doing what you're doing. Otherwise, without coaching, you can't see what is stopping you because it is hidden from your view. Why is it hidden? Because it's been there so long, because you're so used to it, because it's part of your comfort zone, because it's just become who you are and it's invisible to you. 
this is not just you. This is all human beings. All human beings have blind spots. Now, the smartest people, they always get coaching. They always get mentors. They always have help to get to their next level. Anyone that you can think of on this planet who is highly successful, none of those people have gotten there alone. All of them have had help. It's the other people who want to keep struggling and keep failing. They don't reach out and get help. And hey, if that's their choice. They can, you know, keep failing. That's up to them. It's their life. You have to make your own decisions for your life and for your body. And decide if you're worth fixing these problems once and for all. If you want to fix them once and for all, you get coaching to get that done. And with that being said, there's several things that go into transforming yourself on the inside so that it's just not any big deal. It's not a struggle to do the things that you've got to do to live healthy and fit because there's no magic, folks, all right? There's no magic pill that's going to get that weight off of your body and keep it off. You absolutely have to change your eating habits, but when you're not willing to let the struggle go and when you're not willing to raise your own level of hope that it really is possible and that you could have it too and then you're not willing to take action to get those results that you're going to hear these eight people talking about here in this special sub-series of the JoLynn Braley Show well then just take full personal responsibility for your results Take full personal responsibility for your eating habits, for your weight, for your choices, for your decisions. And you know what? That's cool. It is your life. And you get to make up whatever stories you want to make up. That's just how it is. You know, let's get real. There's no two ways about it. You're either going to change or you're not. You don't want to change? Great. Don't complain about your overweight. Don't complain about how hard it is for you to quote unquote give up your food. The thing is, once you've got struggle free weight loss, you don't feel like you're giving anything up because it's totally your choice to live a healthy lifestyle. Struggle free freedom. You got to get that inner self sorted out though. And there's no magic pill for that. And uh, so we're just kind of going in circles here a little bit. You either want to change or you don't. If you want to change and you want to reinforce your level of hope that you can, listen to all eight of these upcoming audio interviews and raise your level of hope and take action. You got to take action in order to stop struggling with food and your weight. Your binge eating, your emotional eating, your overweight, your self-sabotage, your self-doubts, all of that stuff, your frustration, your food obsessions, your negative self-talk, it's not just going to go away. Nothing changes unless you take action to change it. Does that make sense? Remember, if you want my help, get started now, www.discovery-session.com. I'll be back with you for the first interview in the special sub-series of the JoLynn Braley Show. I am JoLynn Braley, permanent weight loss coach, founder of the Inner Self Diet, the diet that actually works, the only diet that really counts because it removes your struggle and self-sabotage so that you can finally do the healthy lifestyle program that already works for you, okay? You've already had success in the past, but then you sabotaged yourself. So if you could just do that healthy lifestyle program that worked for you before and do it totally without struggle, what would be the problem? The inner self diet removes the battle. It removes the binge eating motivators. It removes the emotional eating motivators. It removes the gunk. It removes the inner fat. It gives you the correct psychology for weight loss so that you are totally, all systems go, and it's just not any big deal anymore because all struggle lives inside of you. It's all in you. It's all in your inner self. Clear that up and you'll be golden. But you got to take action to do it and you need the full step-by-step system to do it. I wish you your best life living inside of your ideal body.